You're watching WGN Morning News at 7. 7.20, time for Round Town. Anna's at the Hyde Park Art Center. Hey, Anna. Hey, good morning. They're celebrating their 70th anniversary, and I've known this place to be a think tank, think tank, a center for independent artists who have unique art. You know how they're celebrating their 70th anniversary, Larry and Robin? What? With a fry-off. Oh, oh, look at this. Oh. These people are after a heart. He is actually putting bacon in batter. That's, that's like, <laughs> that's just indulging. Wow. And then over here, this man, Philip, gives a new name to a fried egg. Check that out over there. That's a fried egg. When we wow. come back, we'll tell you more about how you can come over here and fry to your heart's content. They'll put anything in a deep fryer for you. Oh, but you're going to have to eat it. Details coming up. We have been right. deep frying things in my family for yep. generations, so I'm that's the place for me. <laughs> Can't go wrong. But first, let's check in with Anna around town. Hey, Anna. Larry and Robin, I'm in Hyde Park. Vegetarians and carnivores deep fry their differences, and it's all in the name of art. 70 years history of it. Details right after the break around town. I love that shirt she's got. Oh, she's it? darling. It's darling, oh, it's darling on us. Great time now for Round Town. Anna's at the Hyde Park Art Center, uh, deep frying stuff. Hey, Anna. I love it. Perfect day with this humidity and 85 degrees at 730. Fantastic to fry. I'm here with Kate Lorenz. This cultural institution is turning 70. You sit down in that meeting and you say, let's have a frying competition. What the heck? <laughs> well, this is actually kind of a typical day at the Hyde Park Art Center. <laughs> Actually, this is part of our 70th anniversary celebration, 70 days for 70 years. Um, these artists came to us with the idea. They're part of, they're actually represented in the exhibition behind us, mm -hmm. Artists Run Chicago. So on the left, we have Kevin, and he's in charge of representing us carnivores, mm -hmm. right? That's right. And then on our right side, we have Philip, and he is the vegetarian dude. That's right. They're, they're dueling. So really, everyone can get into it and pick a side. This is Saturday, and so how does it work? Anyone can bring whatever they want to fry? Anyone can show up between three, five and eight, five and eight this Saturday, um, and bring whatever you think will fit in that frying pan, and they fry it, you eat it. It has to be edible. It, ha it has to be edible, yeah. You can't bring like, you your lounge chair or anything like that, right? Whatever you're willing to eat. All right, I got to talk to my carnivore man here, Kevin. Why in the world would you dip bacon in batter and then fry it? Why not? It's delicious. Right? So how does it work? Um, essentially, people participate. We ask them to bring things that they think would be interesting to put in the fryers. What's the weirdest thing you fried? Somebody brought an entire tube of, like, liverwurst sandwich spread. And we battered that up and put it in the deep fryer, and it was probably one of the strangest things that we've had somebody bring and eat. That's pretty interesting. Reason. I got to try that bacon when we come back, but I got to talk to the vegetarian dude. I got to tell you, Philip, this gives a new meaning about being a healthy vegetarian. I don't think that exists. You're going to fry... Grapes? Grapes. How do we do? Just like that? Yeah. And they don't explode? No. What's the weirdest thing you've fried? I think the head of iceberg lettuce is one of the weirder things. How did that turn out? Um, it was, uh, I, I didn't want to eat it. No? Unappetizing looking. What are you dying to fry? Um, I, there are a lot of things that are great. I mean, beer battered pineapple is a favorite every year. Bananas are very popular with the kids. I love it. Uh, and of course, he has the plethora of donuts, carrots. Uh, Pop-Tart. Yeah, Pop-Tart, hard-boiled egg. Uh, those are some mozzarella sticks. Here's a grape that we fried earlier. And uh, judging by the audience, if we could turn around, you got to see these people. You know, you think they're artsy folks. They're not going to eat fried stuff. Look at the crowd I have right here. This guy has had five wrapped wrapped bacon battered stuff. Are you okay? I'm, I'm doing all right. I'm feeling a little sluggish and a little bit heavy, but it's bacon. Right. Bacon. Text us if you need more information about their 70th anniversary. When we come back, I promise, I'll show you some real art. Back to you. It's bacon, Larry. Mm -hmm. Bacon. Oh. Everything's better with bacon. the bacon and fry it in the pan. That's right. Thanks, Anna. Time now for Round Town. Anna's at the Hyde Park Art Center. Hey, Anna. This is a great idea for a date night. I'm in the clay room, and what's going on in here, Kate? This is our event, Cocktails and Clay, that we do the second Friday of every month. Alcohol and sculpting, I, it, that's like a dangerous combination. It's a fun combination. <laughs> yeah, some pretty interesting things get made. Is it free? It's um, free. There's a voluntary suggested donation, but anyone's welcome. Who puts the booze? Um, Bar Louie. Oh, mm -hmm. fantastic. Mm -hmm. So free drinks, too? 
cast drinks. Perfect. Yep. All right, I love that idea. What I don't know is I'm kind of worried about this lady over here because I don't know how she's doing with the wheel and that glass of whatever it is she's drinking. <laughs> but towards the end, salud, cheers. We'll figure out. No, it's all water. We all know it's water. It's 7 in the morning. You can't be drinking this early. Oh, no, it's 8. Back to you guys. Thanks, Anna. Time now for Around Town. Anna's at the Hyde Park Arts Center. Hey, Anna. Hey, good morning. It is about our art here, even though we've been frying all morning and playing with clay and drinking. This is one of the galleries at the Hyde Park Art Center celebrating its 70th anniversary. Hi, Kate. Hi there. So what are we looking at in here? This is our one of our current exhibitions, Artist Run Chicago. Mm -hmm. It's a representation of about 35 different artist run galleries and spaces from around the city um, that we're showcasing here at the center. And pretty much these people have this in their homes, and that's their gallery. Oftentimes, yeah. Mm -hmm. Artists are resourceful create a bunch who just um, find find spaces to show their work and experiment with new projects. But I hear some hip-hop going on. If we go into the main building, you will see the light is going to change on you, so adjust your eyes, please. What's going on in here, Kate? We've got a hip-hop workshop going on. This is, an, again, part of our 70 Days Festival, where we're working with a bunch of creative people from around the city. Mm -hmm. um, this is John, who's mm -hmm. teaching a hip-hop class mm -hmm. for us. And um, it's just one example of the many creative things happening in 70 days. If you go to our website, HydeParkArt.org, mm -hmm. um, you can find out other stuff that's happening as well. That's fantastic. Text us for more information. Kate Lawrence, thank you so much. You're so welcome. Always so fun to have to be here. All right, guys, that's it for Around Town. Back to you. Thanks, Anna. So